This rock wall is an example of sedimentary rock. Sedimentary rocks are derived from igneous, sedimentary, and metamorphic rocks. Sedimentary rocks make up around 75% of the rocks on the Earth's surface. Let's take a look at how clastic sedimentary rocks form. Clastic sedimentary rocks are the group of rocks most people think of when they hear the term sedimentary rocks. Clastic sedimentary rocks are made up of pieces of pre-existing rocks called clasts that vary in size. These sedimentary rocks follow WED CC in order to form, which stands for weathering, erosion, deposition, compaction, and cementation. Weathering is when pre-existing rocks are broken down. This may occur by freezing and thawing of water inside the cracks of rocks, trees and other plants growing into cracks, and even blowing winds. Next, you have erosion, which occurs when these class or pieces of rocks are created during weathering and then are transported by either wind, water, or even gravity to a new location. Deposition is when the particles are deposited as loose sediment. Usually this is near a body of water, but not always. Over time, compaction occurs as layers of deposition build on top of one another and begin to squeeze together. Cementation occurs eventually when the minerals in the water will act like glue and cement all the pieces together. The end result is a sedimentary rock. This process of loose sediment hardening into rock by cementation and compaction collectively is called lithification. If you'd like to know more about sedimentary rocks, this playlist will help. And as always, thanks for watching. And Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.